Hello everyone, my name is John. Today I will tell you how to set up data upload from the Pipedrive CRM system to Salesforce CRM. This is necessary in order to automatically transfer new deals from Pipedrive to other systems. For example, in Salesforce CRM, create leads every time a new deal is added to Pipedrive, it is convenient to store, process and interact with them in every possible way in the future. Now let's move on to the setup. First you need to create a new connection. Next, you need to select the Pipedrive data source system. Then you need to select an action get new deals. At this point you need to connect your Pipedrive account to the Apex Drive service. In this window, you must specify the domain and API key. In order to get this data, you need to go to your Pipedrive account. Now you need to copy the domain from the address bar. Please note that the domain must be copied without additional characters. Next, return to the Apex Drive service and paste the domain in the required field. Now you need to specify the API key, for this go to Pipedrive. Next, in the Personal Preferences section, go to the item, API. Copy the API key and paste it into the appropriate field in the Apex Drive service. When the required fields are filled, click Save. When the connected login is displayed in the list, select it and click Continue. In this case, there are no additional settings, so just click Continue. At this stage, you can set up a data filter, in this case there is no need for this, so we also click Continue. At this stage, you see test data for your transaction from Pipedrive, if everything suits you, click Next. This completes the Pipedrive data source configuration. Now you need to proceed to the data ingestion configuration. Choose Salesforce CRM as the data ingestion system. Next, you need to select an action, create lead. At this stage, you need to connect your Salesforce CRM account to the Apex Drive service. Enter your username and password. Next, check your mail to which the verification code should come and paste it into the required field in the Apex Drive system. When the connected account is displayed in the list, select it and click Continue. At this stage, you need to fill in the fields with variables from Pipedrive. In order to assign a variable, click on the field to which you need to transfer data and select the required variable from the drop-down list. Please note that you can not only add variables, but also prescribe values manually. Press Enter to move to the next line.
When all the necessary data is assigned, click Continue. At this point, we see the test data that will be sent to Salesforce CRM. In order to check the correctness of the settings, click Send Test Data to Salesforce CRM. If everything suits you, we return to the Apex Drive service and continue the configuration. On this, the data reception setup has been successfully completed, now you need to enable auto-update. Select the communication interval, for example once every 5 minutes. That's all, I wish you successful integration settings and good luck.